Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Dot TV. I'm Katia I'm Katiaiko, and in the last episode we uh, did these avatar battles. Yeah, in this episode we're gonna do more of them. Actually, we're gonna finish them off in this episode. This episode, by the time this is over, um, all the avatar battles will have been done. Yep. Isn't that cool? That's totally cool. Nobody cares. That's how it goes. No one cares. I don't even care. Fuck it. Doesn't matter. I'm busy doing something. It doesn't make any sense, but I was doing a thing. Well, this voice actress has done hardly nobody, but she did do a good job with the one voice that I do know. Interesting. There was, there was a new anime coming out next season, summer season. It's, uh, it's called Blood Lad that I was going to watch, and I've read the manga, so I was looking through the voices of the people who were going to voice the main characters. Yeah, that makes sense. And I was looking at the, the, the voice actress for Belle. She's only done one character that I know. The other one is somebody from this season's anime, but I haven't watched it, so... Whatever. She did do a good voice, though, in the, in the one that she did. Otherwise, she's only got three voices under her belt. But still, though, one major role is pretty good. Pretty good. Did a good job, I don't mind. She'll be fine for Belle. Her voice probably fit perfectly, actually, now that I read it, because Asuka's voice was pretty much the same kind of character. <clears throat> but, yep. The person doing the main character, I like him. He's actually quite busy this season, man. He's doing three characters in just this season. He's doing uh, Marco and Shingeki no Kyojin, or Attack on Titan, if you want to think his name. And he's doing... Um, Haruto in Valbrave, Kakumiki Valbrave, and then he's doing Mao in Hataraku Mao sama So, he's got three voices going on, although he's soon to have two. But I won't tell you why. <laughs> Actually, I do wonder though, when is- how many episodes is Kakumiki Valbrave and Hataraku Mao sama supposed to have? I think Shingeki no Kyojin is supposed to end at like 25 or something. I will now look this up. Because it's not like I need to talk about these, you've already seen these fights. Let's see. Hataraku Mao Dash. Just some. Enter. Hataraku Mao Sama. Oh, that's supposed to be 13 episodes. I'm gonna be so sad then. I think already 10 has aired. What was the last episode that aired? Was it 10? Hataraku Mao Sama airs on Saturday, so. Saturday anime. No, wait, what's that tomorrow? Someone airs on Thursday. Yeah. Episode 10 just stayed okay. Yeah. So that means only three more episodes. All of my anime is gonna end at the same time. Hatara Kamao Sama ends at episode 10 or 13. So does Shingeki or so does Devil Survivor to the animation that ends at 10. And then um Suse no Gargantia Gargantia ends at 13 as well. Did I say Devil's Forever ends at 10? It doesn't end at 10, it ends at 13. So there's two, those three anime all end at episode 13. And now I'm going to check. Uh, what was the last one I'm going to check? Kakumiki Val Reef Kakumiki Val Reef. Enter. Spelled something wrong. <laughs> God damn it. K A K U M P I K I. B A L V R A V E. Found it. I spelled something wrong the first time. I don't know what I spelled it wrong. Uh, it'll have 12 episodes. Really? Kaki Miki Valvrave is gonna end in. Two. What episode was it? I think? Kaki Miki Valvrave had only 9 episodes. Yeah, so it's got 3 more episodes. Because it's got 10, 11, and 12. How are they gonna wrap it up in 3 episodes? Are they gonna do it? Oh, I think there was another season I was confirmed, wasn't there? Something stupid. Well, that's good, I guess. Getting tired of Kakamiki Valrave. I'm surprised I watched it this far, in all honesty. Once it ends, I won't have to deal with it for a while until season 2 airs, and then for some reason I'll go watch that. I don't know why, but I probably will. I don't, I don't even know. I don't. I got a new email. My phone vibrated. Let's see what it says real quick. And it is 
Twitch TV. FFS TV just went live. Good for them. I don't really care. Look, I paused it. I was trying to skip that cutscene. I learned while fighting that you could skip cutscenes. Anyways, the anime I'm interested in watching for summer, though, the next season, is uh, Blood Lad and Danganlopa, Lopa, the animation. Free, just because I feel like it. The world God only knows. Because I like that. And. Skip my. Uh, Kamisama no Inai Michiobi. The main reason I want to watch that one though is because Madhouse animates it. Madhouse also does um, Hunter Hunter 2011. And it's fucking beautiful, so I want to see that because it's probably going to be beautiful. And then. Uh, there's, there's going to be a short, an anime short that's going to air called Senyu that I'm going to watch. I think there was another one. Where was it? Uh, I don't know. I did think there was another one I was going to watch, though. I don't remember the name of it. Because I didn't care until it aired, and once it started airing, I'd probably memorize the name of it. That was my logic. Where's yours? You don't have any logic. That's right. No, I don't really know. I'm just weird like that. Anyways, I thought... I thought for coolness. And maybe... And, and totally not so I can extend the... the length of the video. I would show the Kubia fight at normal speed. Definitely not to make sure that everything is... That this, the, the episode was more than 12 minutes long. It wasn't that at all. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't. Anyways. You know what, I just realized I'm still behind on Tawara Kagaki no Railgun. I watched the episode where Accelerator came by and fucked shit up and it was awesome. But, uh... I haven't watched any more since then. Should probably watch more of that. I don't know. I'm looking through the anime list right now. I don't really think any of them are that great. So you say no Gargantia is gonna have some sort of special or something? I don't know. I really like Suisei no Gargantia and shit's going down right now. Like the last episode, latest episode was just like, whoa. I'd say, I talk about Shingeki no Kyoji, but since I already read the manga, I already know what's going to happen, so it's not that big of a deal. Like, nothing, they're not going to throw anything that I'm not going to know what's going to happen unless they start going away from the manga and screwing shit up, which is a possibility. I hope it doesn't happen, because that would suck. Like, a lot. I don't know. I, I don't. I can, I can, I don't, I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. English, I don't speak it. All I know is I need to get this recorded. And then I need to record more of this. I'm almost done with this. They're gonna have a second season of Magi the Eleventh of Magic. I didn't know that. I'm not looking at the se the fall season. It's gonna be Kuroko no Basket, Basuke uh, 2. It's gonna be a Blaze Blue memory. I'm reading the title. I'm, not, I'm never sure if it was Blaze Blue or Blaze Blue. I always want to say Blaze, but my friends told me it was Blaze, but anyways. Alter memory is gonna be to making an anime. Interesting. What else is there that I possibly know? Oh, there's Kakimiki Valvrave Season 2 in fall. Well, at least they get a whole season without it. I guess. I don't fucking know. Oh, Persona 3, the movie's gonna be coming out in that season too. And the DVD probably won't be out for a few months after that. And then I'll just be like, no, Give me the DVD. And then it probably won't be subbed for another... I don't know, month or two. <laughs> It'll probably be half a year before I get that movie, even though... Even though it's gonna come out... Just later this year. 
fall. I didn't know Madoka Magica had a movie. Because apparently the third movie is coming out in fall, but I didn't even know there was two before it. I never really watched Madoka Magica. I watched the first three episodes. Could have been five. It was either five or it was three episodes. And I watched the first ones. And it was interesting, but I, I never kept going with it. I don't know why. I suppose I could. Infinite Stratos Season 2. I never finished the first season of Infinite Stratos. It doesn't matter to me. I'm totally talking about the game that's going on in the background right here. Totally not talking about anime. What is this fucking anime you're talking about? I don't even give a shit. No. Ooh. If I clicked on Winter, is that last season's Winter? Yeah, it is. Or, I guess it was not really... Well, technically it was just a season ago. So, whatever. Uh, I'm behind on Carnival. I wonder if I should watch Carnival. Carnival was interesting, but I'm kind of bored of Carnival. I don't know. It's just like Ginga K Kikotai Majestic Prince. I dropped that one after like two episodes. Sorry, Ginga Kikotai Majestic Prince. <laughs> Devil Survivor 2. It's just a little bit more of that. I don't even know what ending they're going for at this point, in all honesty. Because they've killed off, like, so many characters I feel like they shouldn't have killed off. I don't know. Maybe these guys are just bad at saving lives. I mean, come on, Hibiki. When I played the game for the first time, I only got Keita killed. How come you managed to get everybody else killed? You know? Although the last episode... <laughs> The last episode- I have no idea what the fuck happened in the last episode. It was really weird. I mean, it was good, I guess. But it was weird, because the shit that happened didn't actually happen in the game as far as I know. I haven't beaten the game, but I asked my friend who's beaten it, and he's like, Nope, that was never a thing in the game. And I go, okay, so that's a thing in the anime, but it's not a thing in the game. And it was really cheesy, the end of the, the, the newest episode, episode 10, I think it was. It was really cheesy, but it was nice. And the music that played, the ending song, kind of, I guess, just for that episode, was really pretty, so I don't really have a problem with that. It was fine. It's just like, why didn't you follow the game more? Then again, I do have a friend that makes a pretty good point. Why would you want to watch an anime about a game just to see the game all over again when you can play the game again? My responses. I want to see the game. <laughs> I like the game because it was a good game, so I want to see the anime follow the game story because it was good. I don't know. Plus it's nice to see some of my favorite scenes animated, which I actually kind of went they had wished they had gone with a... I don't know, a different kind of personality for the main character. Because in the game you can give your character, you can make your character really silly. Like, if someone knocks on the door, every time every time someone knocks on your door to call your name and ask if you want to go hang out or just to talk to you in the mornings, you can, every single time, you can yell, PERVERT! Every time. And that's hilarious. And I used to, I choose that one every once in a while. It's funny, because then, like, the people who are knocking on the door, they get all flustered, like, what? I'm sorry. <laughs> it's funny, though. I don't know. Am I weird? I'm weird. But it's just... It was fun. And so you, the main character just had some really silly choices that you could make. So I kind of wish that he would kind of be the same, but it's still funny at times. Like in episode uh, 9, when the anguished one showed up in Hibiki's room, and everybody freaked out. Well, Hibiki freaked out, and then he said, fine, you can stay in my room. And then um, Io and Daichi walked in and saw the English one, and they both freaked the fuck out, and it was just an all-around hilarious scene, so, I don't know. It's still pretty funny, I guess. A little bit. It wasn't very funny, those was a little... So, Jim. But they tried to kill off of you. Which, I guess, is fine. I really don't like you. Oh, man, is this fight done yet? It would've been done if I'd sped it up, but I didn't. Let's check Twitter. This is a bunch of news from video games. Speaking of video games, EA is like tomorrow, or at least Nintendo's conference or Nintendo's Nintendo Direct. 
is in 16 hours. Right now, and it's 2 o'clock right now, so... This will probably get up by 4 o'clock, so then it'll be 16, 15, 14 hours. Maybe. It all depends, I guess, if you watch it right when it goes up, or if you watch it later, or maybe a few years later. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. I know E3 is coming up. I'm excited. I've already got my dish set to record it from Spike TV, and then I'm probably gonna watch it on YouTube. It's YouTube streams it again this year. It'll be awesome, you guys. I'm always excited for E3. Even if I come out of it disappointed, I'm always excited. I don't know. Anyways, that is all of the um, avatar battles that you can do the film simulation thing. Afterwards, I show you all of the wallpapers that I got because I can. That's the reason. You see how the wallpaper looks now? That was way a long time ago when I recorded this. A long time ago, before I changed it to what it is. So there's that one. It's a kite, and then Balmung and Orca. And this one. With Sakaki, that fucking bastard. I would never keep that wallpaper up. I hate him. Then you've got, um, Fidel. 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 And then you got fucking Ovan's face right in front of your face. His face is in my face. And then this one, which is the Kubia. It's the Kubia guy. Yeah, and then the last one here, which is everybody from like the first games, kind of. Isn't that cool? That's cool. Anyways, that is all I have for now. I gotta record a little bit more to get it finished up, but we'll do that. So thanks everybody for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.